she don't play with that bass shit. I be fucking this NBA nigga bitch, you know I ain't never gonna say shit. New contract being like I play ball, little boy ain't nothing to play with. I told her pull up, she told me she can't, her nigga be sharing location. Yeah. I was riding in the car. What's going on guys? My name is Joseph Roback. I play linebacker here at Washington State. And this is a day in life. So it's currently so it's currently 622. Um I was trying to wake up at around 6:15, 6:30. First thing I do is start the day. Get some natural sunlight. You know, say what's up to the boy. Brother Capenna. What's up, bro? Doing some working know. in the morning. Getting the homework done. You see it? Boom, 6.30. Cook up a light breakfast. All right, check it out, check it out. Ketchup on top, just some light proteins. All right, guys. Um, so, I'm about to hit the sauna right now for like 15 minutes. Get a good sweat in the morning, warm up all the muscles, uh, taking out the trash. But yeah, you know, so it's up to the whip. So, you know, I'll give you a little something about myself. I'm a sophomore here. I'm going into my true sophomore year. Uh, going into my junior year, academic wise, you know, I'm studying finance. For any of you finance majors out there. Um, you know, I'm from Hawaii, Big Island, Island boy. But yeah. Here we are. All right, so a little update. The sauna's broken apparently, so you know. Instead, we're gonna hop in the hot tub, get our body flowing, get the muscles flowing. You know what I mean? Uh, so the biggest thing here the uh, hot tub for me is uh, I like to get all my stretching done in here it's because your body is already getting loose getting warm so it's the best way to just start loosening up your muscles even more by just getting some stretches in all right so we're about to head back to the crib right now get a shower in and then probably head to the facility all right after that Keep you guys updated so it's about nine o'clock right now uh, i'm about to finish getting ready pick up a couple of the boys and head to the facility oh uh, so the drive to the facility is about like two minutes it's not far from where i live uh, yo this is bro number one What's up to the family? What's up, man? What what you do like? It's the uh it's the day in the life video. Uh. Oh, yeah, man, it's uh it's goon number two. Goon number two, what's up, Donnie? Mmm. Mmm. Yo, you know, day in the life, man. We about to get this work in, man. Talk to him. Man, you already know we do this for real. This is D1 lifestyle, man. We about to work these legs. We about to get the pump in the arm. We about to go do this football school. Football IQ is the main thing about football. And, man, we about to get it, man. Ha, 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 ha. Yeah, Eric. 
the facility. Where the business comes in. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Day one. On the trip. Well, I'm not day one on the trip. Twenty change. Hey, cool. What's happening? What is it? <laughs> <laughs> Gotta get. Gotta get the snacks. Gotta get the cars and your man. You got the meeting rooms. You know they really, uh, they really did us dirty. Took our, took our room away, but yeah, it's all good. Well, I'm back. It's on top of my room, man. Sad. You know where it. You know where it at. Say what's up to the. Say what's up to the locker room. You know, about to get this. About to get this lift in. <laughs> All right, guys, I'll see you guys after the <laughs> lift. Hey, some uh, words of encouragement to the kids. If you ain't getting a swole, you ain't getting right. You heard me? That's all I gotta say. First day out here, man. I'm trying to make a name for myself out here, you know what I'm saying? Fresh trying to get big, man. I'm a freshman, 17 years old, man. Uh, you know, just a little, mm, just a little something. Oh! Yeah, put him in. All right, you know, intern Joe. This is Joe Roback. I'm about to open up his hips, if you know what I mean. Whoa, pause. Oh. Oh, wow. I get some food. This is where it gets done. Mm. Bye. <laughs> you got your face. What's going on? Wait, wait, wait. Buddy. Oh. Hey. Buddy. Hey. I just grabbed some food. About to hit the training room for some recovery. Yeah. More. Hey, shout out the vlog, man. Shout out the vlog, man. We out here. Caps lock, bro. Dude, what are we shaving over here? Caps lock, bro. What's up, bro? Is that Coach? Oh, Jake Bowe. There you know. There you know. It's Caps lock, bro. You've seen him before in the morning. Come on, now. Ridgeway. Big Mott. Gang, gang. Arnt. Yup. Pete. Yup. Steve, yo. Yeah. I'm gonna hit this and I'm gonna do a, uh, I'm gonna get some icing on my knee, man. It's rehab for my MCL, man. You always got prehab to stay on that field. The best you ever be on the field is availability. If you can't be available, you ain't no asset to your team. Remember that. 
Facts, that's why recovery is most important. And I'll chill here. You can get your boots on, chill in the massage chair, a bunch of stuff you can do. All right, it's about 12 o'clock now. Just about to leave the facility now. Light day, deload week. Check out Martin. Uh, head back to the crib now. Uh, come back here later, do some extra work right before dinner opens. But yeah, you know, it's a light day in the office today. That's all I can say. All right, guys. Just got back to the crib. Took a nice little shower. And now I'm probably just gonna hang out. Chill outside on the hammock. Oh, uh, I think I might go hit the pool with some of the guys later. Um, but yeah, I'll check back with you guys later. All right, what's up, guys? It's, uh, it's about three o'clock now I think yeah it's about three o'clock uh, I'm gonna go get extra work in at four but we'll stop by one of the guys houses he's making some food so you know support the teammates and hang out there for a little while I know the best thing about summer is that you can just make bonds greater bonds with your teammates and it's a great time for people to sit around and hang out, so so we're on to right now. Oh, you got more back out there? Oh, you can grab more back out there. Hey! Yeah. Hey, go! And he's like, why didn't you guys say anything? Doesn't matter! Whoa! <laughs> so, guys, uh, just left the house, heading over to the facility right now, got another workout in. All right, let me give y'all a tip. Whenever you can find free parking, you take free parking. Cause ain't nobody trying to pay $500 for a parking pass that's just as far. So yeah, you know, low tip for you guys out there. Find out where the free parking spots is early. Finish the workout. About to head outside, catch some balls, work on the ball skills. Yes, sir, let's get it. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Oh my god, what is that? 
Wait, this way. What is that? Oh, what? Uh, oh my <laughs> God. Hey, I didn't even know it was close to my lungs. Hey, man. You know. Yeah, you know, uh, this little Lowe's. Yeah, see low. You know what it is? About to get smoked in FIFA. Come on, bro. Every time you play me, I beat you. This is what we do, guys. Take dubs. Take dubs. You know my boy Lowe's have to dip out of here, but you see it. Yeah. But gotta head to the crib, get ready for work. See you guys there. You know it's uh 6:30 right now. Work till should be done around 10. Quick little three and a half hours. But yeah, I'll check in with you guys after this. What's going on guys just finished work it's 10 05 now uh, gonna head back to the, to the crib get ready for bed I'll see you guys there what's up guys just got back home gonna get ready for bed now it's almost 10 30 right right about the same time i go to bed every night and yeah guys this is the conclusion of my day uh, i want to appreciate you guys for coming spending the time to check out how the day my life goes um one thing i want to put out there is for anybody you know trying to get to this level you know the your journey doesn't end where you think it might end. Like for example, with me, uh, I ain't got no scholarships out of, I got no offers out of high school. Um, last time I played football was my junior year in high school. And my story is I enrolled here at Washington State as a regular student. I sat a whole year out, trained by myself for two years and I finally was given a walk on tryout spot. Killed it at the tryout. It's been history ever since and just grateful for the opportunity, but it just comes to show that your journey doesn't end where you think it ends. I thought my I thought I was done with football after high school. And look at me now. So it's all about the hard work you put in and just having that mindset that no matter what goes wrong, there's always a brighter side to the story. You just have to fight through it. But again, appreciate you guys. Um, go Cougs.